and I just arrived in here at Casino Niagara in uh, Niagara Falls, Ontario. We're going to do our first quick hand review. So you did pretty good today. I ended up cashing in about eleven $1 hundred dollars. <laughs> Sweet. You know, stay here. Sure. I'm freaking lost. All right, welcome to the first Quick Hands episode. And uh, we have an interesting hand today. Uh, we just finished our session here at uh, Falls View, actually Niagara Falls Casino in uh, Niagara Falls, Canada. So we were, we were playing 2-5, we, we were down about $500 and uh, we ended up making $1,500 when we hopped into 5-10. So our hand begins with us being on the button and we have five, six of diamonds. Uh, it's six handed and uh, it limps on the cutoff. So we decide to go to 35. Uh, we don't really want to go too much. I mean, we want to play on the button. I, we could go 40 here. I don't think uh, there's any reason to, uh, uh, to fluctuate any higher than 40. So anyways, we go 35 and uh, small blind folds and now the big blind completes and then the, the cutoff that uh, that opened for, for a limp uh, he calls to. So three way to the flop. So we take the flop and we get a seven, nine, five with two clubs out there and we have two diamonds in our hands. Uh, there's a nine of hearts. Uh, it goes check, check. And there's no reason to really bet here with our hand. I mean, we just have bottom pair, which is, it's okay. Um, if we bet, we're not really folding out anything worse, I don't think, uh, or anything better. We're just gonna get called by worse. So our hand does have some value, but we do have some improvements. We can get an eight for a straight. Uh, we can trip up. So it's pretty good to just check back. So we check it and uh, boom. What do we get on the turn? We get the eight. Uh, not a bad card. Although we don't have the nuts, we do have a straight. So it's pretty good. Uh, now the big blind decides to lead $100. Throws in a $100 chip. And uh, the cutoff snap folds. Um, there's nothing else to do here. I mean, uh, 10 jack is the nuts. He could potentially have 10 jack. And uh, he could also have a club draw that didn't decide to bet the flop. Uh, he could have a backdoor heart draw. Um, and he could have a bunch of other stuff too. I mean, he could have two pair, he could have trips. Yeah, I don't really know. Uh, so anyways, there's a whole bunch of stuff that he can have. And uh, we're beating a whole ton of it. Um, so it's not a bad play to just call here. I don't think that you want to put too much money in the pot. You you want to raise it up and uh, be in a bad spot here if he decides to put any more money in. So, um, yeah, we call and what do we get on the river? We get a jack. Like, who wants to see a jack on the river? Now, at this point, man, we don't really like our hand too much because a 10 beats us, a 10 makes us straight, and obviously 10 jack is no longer the absolute nuts. Um, so we could have got screwed by like, uh, you know, queen 10 of hearts or something like that. Ah, he bets 150 and nothing else to do but just call. So we call and hope that he turns some hand, like a two pair hand into a bluff um, or trips or something like that. Or just have complete missed hearts. I mean, he could have, uh, he could have had... Uh, ace X of hearts, could have had uh, ace X of clubs that decided to bet and he paired up on the river or something. So we decided to call and we're good. Now, to my surprise, what does he show? He shows freaking king, king, two kings and their hearts. So I don't know what he was thinking pre-flop, but uh, you know. It's always good to, to raise your hands. If he would have raised his, his hand pre-flop, we, we would have never been in there. And uh, he would have taken down a pretty pretty decent pot. I mean, why not take uh, $45 pre-flop if, if you can take it then and there? I mean, I, I probably have the button, so I might even call, right? We were really deep pre. We were like uh, $1,500 deep, so. 
anyway that was on hand quick hands and thanks for watching guys like subscribe comment i uh, like to hear what you guys think and uh hopefully catch you next time take it easy six five let's go play it to the river bet 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 i don't know i'll call you down come on let's go